ladies, there's something in us. When we see a strain go down the crack of your ass, give a damn how big your ass is. I don't give a damn if when the strain go down there, we don't see it no more. I don't care if your ass swallow that strain up like it's lunch. As long as we know it went down in there and come up in the front, oh, it's going to be some hell up in here this evening. I'll tell you what I know. <laughs> But see, a lot of you women out there and quit doing that because you've been with your man for a while and you done forgot the old saying that the same thing it took to get your baby hooked is going to take the same thing to keep him. Oh, when you first met him, oh, you did it all. Candles all up around the bathtub. Little sexy robe with his initial on it. Little sp spray all over the house. Come in, just he don't know where to start. Yeah, but now, what in the hell do some of y'all wear to bed now? God, some of y'all come to bed looking like anything. Some of y'all come to bed dressed like your ass is going hunting. Thick ass socks, big bag ass sweatpants, big old t-shirt with a knot tied in the front camouflage jacket all you need is a skillet and a canteen we could pitch a tent in this <laughs> and let me ask you something what the hell is bloomers where did you find a pair of drawers so big that they come all up over your stomach right up under your where did you find them big ass drawers at some of your men ain't seen your neighbor in seven years. You knew them drawers was too big when you hung them on the clothesline last week and you looked outside and the little boy next door had been climbed up in them and was outside swinging in your drawers.